Let's go! Newly released police body cam footage shows the dramatic moment when Metro Nashville police officers enter the Covenant Christian Elementary School and fatally wounded the shooter. As officers were uh, approaching uh, the building, there was gunfire going on. They went in, they went through um, door by door as we clear uh, buildings. They heard gunfire. Uh, and immediately ran to that. Authorities say the suspect was a former student, 28-year-old Audrey Hale. Today, the police chief sharing new details from their interview with Hale's parents. She was under care, doctor's care, for an emotional disorder. Uh, law enforcement knew nothing about the treatment she was receiving. But her parents felt that she uh, should not own weapons. Turns out Chief Drake says Hale had legally purchased seven firearms, hiding them within the house. Three of those weapons were used in the deadly shooting yesterday. The three students killed were all nine years old, identified as Evelyn Dickhouse, William Kenny, and Haley Scruggs, the daughter of the church's pastor. We also now have a photo of Evelyn Dickhouse. Her family saying our hearts are completely broken calling Evelyn a shining light in the world. Also killed 61-year-old substitute teacher Cynthia Peake and 61-year-old custodian Mike Hill, who was said to love his job and viewed co-workers and school kids as his family. And the head of the school, 60-year-old Catherine Coons, described by loved ones as a remarkable woman with a bright spirit. The White House now lowering flags to half staff and urging Congress to take action. The majority of the American people think having assault weapons is bizarre. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.